Hello there, just thought I'd make a video today. I've got this um, Chinese stove that I've had before and I'm going to cook some steak on it. So I thought you might want to see. I'll put it together and we'll give it a go in a bit. Right, so this is it then. It's got a little natty bag. It's got a bay. I think it's about £25. Pound. Um, a couple of them. It is a bit of a work up to get together because um, I've obviously already used it and they do warp a little bit. But the way I'm going to use it is I'm going to get that in there. If you can see that to um, keep the fire in. Got it in, yep. And then I'm going to put, got that as well, I'm going to put. Then through there, you can see that, hopefully, if I can get it in, so they're in there, and that one in there, and then plop that in there, brilliant, and then cook on top, and then you put your wood in there, you feed it, and you leave the door open, or you can shut it, but I find leaving it open, and it's just, um, you can see, it's just good. Right, let's do it the old school way. Right, we've got, um, cotton wool buds. Voila, you can see, cotton wool buds. And it's not for my makeup. And here, steel let's try and start the fire with the steel I made that Ta -da. and uh, yeah should get a good spark the right spot where is it there you go sorted right let's get this kindle open a ridiculously big knife to do it. It's quite at the front. It's not particularly sharp, but it's good for battening and chopping up wood. Do we have any little 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 bits in here? Um not really, I'm gonna see if it'll start just with the uh just with the cotton wool buds for now. Let's give it a go. Right, let's get some wood in there then. A bit bent. Okay, that's brilliant. Let's do that. That. Got a couple of little bits here. I might um, chop a bit of wood up there. I don't know, it might be alright with um, just using the uh, cobble, but um, it's very windy today, so let's give it a go. Right, let's get a few of these. Pull them apart. You know this ain't going to work probably because I'm vid uh, recording it, so pull them apart. It'll burn easier. Probably should really chop a few little sticks up as well, but I'm going to just give it a go. Just give it a go. Right, let's get the steel. That's a bit I've already used there, so that should be good. Yes, we there you go, we've got it going. There you go. I think I'm probably going to need to make sticks. A bit more in there. These don't seem to be burning that well. Burn. 
Should have made sticks. It's catching now. Give it a little blow. Yeah, now it's funny because I've got lithium batteries. So I've got an air fryer, I've got a microwave, I've got an induction hob, and I still like cooking my dinner on a little wood stove. Isn't that strange? Yeah, we've got it going. That's good. Brilliant. Let's get it burning a bit more and then I'll be back. Right, all looking good. I'm going to let that burn down to get some hot ashes and then um, we'll stick the steak on. Can't wait. Fire! Fire! Yeah! Right, so I've got one of these from Sainsbury's. What's the chance of it opening? Oh well, it opens. Wow. Four bloody quid that cost. What a rip off. Right, there you go, it's weather thin. Let's put a bit of uh, pepper on it, or maybe that's a lot. No, that's lovely. A bit of pepper. A bit of salt. Cool. Let's get it on the stove. Right, let's get this on then. Bigger than a fork. Let's see how that goes anyway. Right, it's getting there, it's looking good. I to put some more wood on to just like use the actual flames because it's so windy. Windy that um, it wasn't generating enough heat. Yes, heat. I think that is pretty much done. That's windy. Um, there you go, right, there you go, that's dinner, cooked on the mini stove, yeah, could have been better if my battery didn't keep dying, but there you go, maybe next time I'll have a better phone. <clears throat> it's a bit dry, it needs a bit of gravy or something, maybe next time, yeah, anyway, that's that video, see you later.